All right, uh, good day, South Africa. Today we are saying that on Thursday with Sboni Somja. All right, um, when you look at the statistics, they tell us that 72% um, of most people's income goes to, to debts, goes to paying uh, for debts, loans, and everything. So that's a, that's a very big problem. If 72% of your income goes to debts, uh, something must change. Something is uh, actually out of uh, control in that sphere. And um, uh, as you know, that uh, 25 million South African are active in terms of um, uh, utilizing credit. And 10 million of those people are behind in terms of payment. They are in areas. You understand? So it means 50% of South African are in debt. And here I'm mentioning the the working individuals, not those who are still studying and so forth. So uh, that means um, uh, almost 80% of South Africans are heavily indebted. It's a big, it's a big, big, big problem. And 94% uh, of that it's personal loans. 94% of that is personal loans. Uh, it means we rely more uh, on loans, and 84% of that is due to irresponsible use of uh, credit. Uh, credit cards, irresponsible use of credit card. I've been there, I've done that. So that is why today I'm a debt counselor registered under National Credit Regulator, license number NCR, uh, DC3326, to help those people who are heavily indebted. And uh, there are so many uh, strategies you utilize to, to help them, including debt review, debt mediation, and, uh, and they recently announced um, amendment, uh, credit bill amendment uh, that um, help people who earn between 7,500 to 50,000 who've got unsecured debts. Unsecured debts, we are talking about um, uh, personal loans, uh, store cards, uh, excluding um, uh, bond or car payments. So th 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 that's not part of uh, unsecured debt. But uh, that's a big, big problem when 70%, actual 76% of uh, uh, many people's debts, it's store cards. Uh, we still rely more on buying uh, food, uh, clothing, and appliances using credit. And uh, mostly it's the thing that we can be able to live without. They are not the needs, they are just the ones, you understand? So uh, that's a big problem we need to talk about and take, take it out. And even the GDP, the, the, the South African debt, it's, it's, it's in trillions now. It's closer to, be, to, to equal GDP. So that means we, we, the country is not making income. So we will rely on um, credit, wire, wire. All right. And then when we rely on credit, that it means we are in a debt economy. And um, the most shocking thing is that um, when I'm looking at, um, as a debt advisor, when I'm looking at monthly... Uh, repo car repositions, yo yo yo, it's it's like five five thousand to seven thousand motor vehicles reposit every month without fail. I understand. So it tells us that it's a big problem. Sometimes we take decisions um, uh, very impulsively, and uh, financial decisions you need to have a, a, a personal financial advisor who will always assist you when you are taking. Uh, those basic, the big decisions. That is why we always avail ourselves to help South Africans, more especially black people, because we tend to uh, to, 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 to know little uh, when it comes to uh, credit, credit law, finance, investments, and, and so forth. So that's a, that's a big problem that we need to, 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 to sort out. And when you look at like um, uh, foreclosures in terms of um, uh, property as a property bro broker uh, currently in the market as in april there are like more than ten thousand uh, properties that are repossessed that we are selling you understand so it's a painful uh, part where you are you are you are you are actually have to sell a property that is a repossessed you are thinking about a lot of things as somebody who deals with money economy finance we analyze those things we are prepared to help people not to get into such troubles. We are in the midst of a um, 21 days lockdown. Uh, that is why if you have uh, credit insurance, you must utilize that. And uh, in terms of um, 
uh, covering your debts because that's the purpose when you you, you, you no longer have income or your income is like um, uh, not coming through and uh, credit um, insurance uh, is for those reasons uh, for such a time as this so um, i was just highlighting a few statistics and then every time every thursday we'll be tackling these issues of um, uh, debts and credit how to get out of debt and uh, you don't have to become a slave to debt all right that's the most important part you didn't go to school in order to be a slave to debt so catch me tomorrow friday as we say finance on friday with the sponsor journey